Good morning students. Welcome to our online video class of chemistry. In previous class we had discussed about osmotic pressure and its application. In this class we will discuss about abnormal molecular or molar mass. Abnormal molar or molecular masses. We know that the colligative properties are used for the determination of molar mass of the solute. It has been observed that the value of molecular mass determined by colligative method do not always agree with the normal values. They may be due to association or dissociation of solute particle. What is abnormal molecular mass? When we determine the molar mass of certain substance by colligative property method it will be higher or lower than the actual value this is called abnormal molar mass or molecular mass and it is due to association or dissociation let us understand now how association and dissociation Let's to abnormal molecular masses. Association. Association means when some of the solute molecules in a solution undergo association to form bigger molecules. The effective number of particles decreases. As a result, the colligative property will show a proportional decrease. Hence the Molar mass of the solute calculated on the basis of measured colligative property will be greater than normal expected value. Or simply we can say if association takes place the molar mass increases. For an example when benzoic acid or acetic acid dissolve in benzene it undergo dimerization due to intermolecular hydrogen bonding so reduction of number of acid molecules take place the colligative property also correspondingly reduced so molar mass will be 120 instead of 60 in the case of dissociation when a solute dissociates in solution into small fragments. Example is electrolyte in echo solution. The effective number of particles increases. As a result, any colligative property will show a proportional increase. Hence, the molar mass of the solute calculated on the basis of the measured colligative property will be less than the normally expected value. For an example, KCl potassium chloride dissociates completely in A1 moderately dilute solution as KCl gives K plus and Cl minus. Here the effective number of solute particles doubles in a dilute solution with a proportional increase in any of the colligative properties. Hence the molar mass of KCl calculated on the basis of measured colligative property will be only half of its normal value. And on other hand, electrolyte dissociates. NaCl dissociates into Na plus and Cl minus and BaCl to barium chloride dissociate into Ba2 plus plus 2 Al minus. Dissociation of molecules cause an increase in number of particles. Hence, observed value of colligative properties are more accordingly the observed molecular mass is lower than the normal value. The Van Hoff factor. The experimental values of colligative properties and molar masses of certain solutes differ considerably from the normal expected values. This is caused by change in molecular state such as association or dissociation undergoes by solute in solution. And the Van Hoff factor is suggested by Van Hoff. 
and it is a value that express the extent of deviation of the experimental values from the normal expected value. The Van Hoff factor is represented by small letter i. Van Hoff factor is defined as the ratio of the observed value of a colligative property of a specific solution to the normal expected value for that colligative property under the same condition. That is Van Hoff factor i equal observed colligative property divided by normal colligative properties. Since any colligative property of the solution is inversely proportional to the molar mass of the solute, the Van Hoff factor then may be defined as the ratio of the normal molar mass of the solute to its value determined experimentally from a colligative property measured. When a solute undergo no change in its molar state such as association or dissociation in solution then i equals 1 otherwise i will not be equal to 1 for example in the case of association the value i will be less than unity and in the case of dissociation it will be greater than unity degree of dissociation alpha equal i minus 1 divided by n minus 1 where n is the number of molecules dissociated and degree of association alpha equals 1 minus i into n by n minus 1 where n is the number of molecules associated. Van Hoff modified the equations for all the colligative properties in case association or dissociation is to be considered. Lowering of vapor pressure. The modified equation is P0A minus PA divided by P0 equals I into HP. Elevation of the boiling point. Delta TB equals I KB into M. Then depression in freezing point. Delta TF equal IKF into M. And the modified equation for osmotic pressure is pi V equal to INRT.